Hello everyone and welcome back to Disco Zoo, the absolutely adorable little pixelated zoo where we have collected so many little animals and it is actually time to go through and start waking up all of the animals in our zoo, all 604 animals, do you see that? That is just so awesome. But we have 30 exhibits and over 600 animals which is just so amazing to me. Oh and we actually sold a sheep so we need to go find another new sheep to add back in here so we have 25 sheep again. Look at them all wearing their little Santa hats. It's so seasonal and festive and adorable. Oh my gosh. And actually, I guess to celebrate the season and the fact that it is winter, we might go to the polar zone today and maybe collect some more of like the northern polar animals because I think we have quite a few we still need to gather up. Look at all of our griffins. Yay, griffins. How many do we have? 13. What? We could almost, we could have more than like, oh, well, we could almost have double that number of griffins. So we might look for some griffins too because they are some of your guys' favorite animals as well. All right, let's go ahead, wake everybody up. Come on, guys. All right, got the Sasquatch up, got the tap dancing penguins up, which is so adorable. There's our seals. We actually have a ton of seals. We almost have 25 seals already. Have a bunch of yaks. We have quite a few polar bears, quite a few walruses, and actually several yeti, which is really fun. That's so cute how they're like laying down and sleeping when they're like that. Look at that. All right. Well, we are going to pop on over to the entrance of the zoo. As you guys can see, I have been saving up a ton of money. I have been coming by and waking everybody up pretty regularly so that we will have lots and lots of money and disco bucks saved up so that we can do really fun stuff like go on these giant expeditions. In fact, let's go check. Do do do. Yay! Let us check how many more animals. 46 more animals until we can upgrade. Mostly the polar zone and the northern zone. Those two zones are the ones where we need the animals collected from. Though we're still missing a few outback, just a couple savanna, and I think maybe just a few farm animals. So there's still lots of animals to be able to collect in all of the different areas. Not to mention the more animals we collect, even if they're duplicates, then the more statues we can have. We've got our little rabbit statue now. We've got the plaque put down for the sheep and the pig. Kangaroo and crocodile also have the plaque. Pa platypus has their bronze statue. Giraffe also has the bronze statue. We've got a lot, a lot of these guys. Actually, I think for Savannah area, we really are pretty much only missing, um, I think that's the griffin in the Savannah. Yeah, that's griffin, isn't it? Let me check. Alright. Oops, went too far. Yeah, that would be Griffin for the Savannah area. Ooh, yay, 100 coins. Thank you so much, happy visitor. Um, so we're missing the Griffin. And then clearly we need to continue to work on like the beaver zone, the northern statue. And we haven't even started working on the polar statue zone. So that'll be pretty fun. But before we get started, you guys always request this. So I'm going to go ahead and we're going to enjoy completely failing at Funky Bus. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh, I got so excited! I was like, wait, I'm actually doing pretty good! Man, no wonder that's so addictive. If you start doing a little bit well on it... Ah, oh, okay, just one last time. If you start doing a little bit well on it... It really is... Pretty addicting. But it's not very... I'm, I don't do very well and it makes me... <laughs> makes me a little nervous to drive again. It's been a while since I have driven anywhere. Alright, so let's go ahead and yeah, we'll start... Actually, let's start looking for a griffin. I want to just jump in, just see if we're lucky enough. Aw, oh, we're not going to find a griffin. Well, Fooey, that kind of didn't go where I was hoping it would. But at least we've got a really awesome hippo. So, there's a hippo at least. And technically we could get this giraffe, but we're going to be okay. Because we're freeing giraffes. I just wanted to see if we'd be lucky enough. Oh, there's a griffin! Alright, we need to find him. Oh, 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 oh. Are you kidding me? We found him! <laughs> That is so awesome! So I was really hoping we would find that griffin. Alright, where's the disco buck? Come on, disco buck. Is it over here? Ah, oh, we were so close, you guys! We were so close. Are we gonna get another griffin? Nope. But we got another giraffe, so that's a good thing. And we're getting closer on... Whoops, if I hadn't fudged that up, I probably wouldn't have been able to snag that hippo, but that's okay. Because we'll look for a griffin again. We've got enough money that it's okay to kind of... <gasps> There's the griffin! It's okay to kind of spend some of it. Oh my gosh, yes! Okay, that's right. It's like a V, like a V. We found the griffin! That is so amazing! And then we're gonna find... Yeah, the lion! So we found the griffin and the lion, which is really useful. So oh, should we find another griffin? Let's just see if we find another griffin, because that would be pretty fun. All right, elephant, I think you're like this. Oh, that was the very first elephant we ever freed! That makes me feel really happy. Why did I do that? 
now I have just fudged up all of the the draft finding bits, but that's okay. It takes a minute to like get back into the swing of the puzzles because I'm a silly Siri, that's why. All right, so this is gonna be our zebra friend. Whoops, you see, I go too fast, I get too excited. I'm like, I found him, but I didn't. Yay, we got the bronze zebra trophy. The zebras have decided to throw a one minute disco party in your honor, yay. All right, so we've got a disco party going on right now at the zoo. All right, well, we'll try. Should we try one more time? Let's go back to the zoo, because we want to see the disco party. Look at everybody, woo! Let's go check out the zebras. Hey, zebras, this is for you. Where are you, zebras? There you are, this is for you. Look at the little, <gasps> a hat, a hat! A visitor has lost a hat in one of the polar exhibits. I want that hat. Oh yeah. Oh, I gotta dance with the zebras for a minute though because it's celebrating zebra time. Did you guys know that zebra stripes are as individual as human fingerprints? Oh yeah. And even though they're black and white, when you see them in the tall grasses of their native habitat, they actually blend in very, very well. Um, and I'm trying to think any other zebra facts I know. Male zebras lead small herds of females and they're actually very, very strict. The males will fight each other, sometimes almost to the death, in order to take each other's females harem away from one another. And that's all the zebra facts I can think about. Zebras are really violent sometimes. That startled me. I remember when I learned that, I was like, oh my gosh, I thought zebras were like peaceful horses. No, they can be very violent. So let's see who has one of our visitor hats. Is it? It's a yak with the most adorable little hat. We are totally buying that. Look at that. A yak. Like he, he's like a Robin Hood yak. That is adorable. All right. Well, let's go see if we can find our Robin Hood yak some friends. So here's our new zebra statue. So the zebras are super happy about that. And 44 more animals. That's a lot of animals, but hopefully we can do it. Let's see how quickly. Let's see what we can do. All right, gonna change over to our polar. Jungle blimp, 250,000 coins. Just reminding myself how much it's gonna cost. So we're gonna jump into polar and off we go. Ooh, so there's a seal hanging around. I'm really good at finding the seals, it seems. The seals and I, we've kind of got a thing going on. All right. Uh, Disco Buck! You eluded me. Disco Bucks to me represent potential future hats, so I get pretty excited about them. All right, okay, here's a penguin. Got a penguin, making our penguins happy. And here's a yak, or excuse me, a muskox. Woo, did we just level out on those guys? I think we just leveled out, like leveled out on the muskox. That's adorable. All right, so let's see. We've got polar bear, penguin, and muskox here. Oh, no, 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 we have one more level to go on them. All right, so, is this it? Okay, we found him. That was pretty easy. So found him, and so this is gonna be, oh, oh, okay, slow down there. Slow down there, Siri. All right, so this is going to be the penguin right here, and the polar bear could potentially either be here or here. Here? Ah, oh, he's gonna be over here. Okay, hang on one second, you guys. Ha, and there we go, we can continue hunting for all of the little creatures. So then the polar bear is gonna be right there. All right, got him, yes! And we leveled up on polar bears. And here's our little penguin, yay! All right, and actually, I've got to say, and this sounds really dumb, but the ads that they show on the Disco Zoo game are so much better, because like, you know, you can watch ads on pretty much any of the online app games. Um, gonna be right here. You can watch ads on like any of these app games to like get extra points and stuff, because you earn the money when you watch the ads, so they'll give you like bonuses in the game. And so like I see them all the time on Jurassic World and I see them all the time on some of the other games that we play But the ones that we actually see on Disco Zoo are like games where I'm actually like hey that looks kind of cool I, I wonder if I'm gonna like try let's playing that in the future like cooking fever and stuff like that um, And there was like this Paradise Island one too that got me pretty excited So let's go ahead and we're gonna see if we can you know what we've got money we're just gonna roll into this. I would have guessed wrong with the walrus too, so I would have felt silly. All right, there's polar bear and a yeti here. Okay, polar bear. So he's gonna be right. Oh, see, that's why you shouldn't move so fast. Polar bear's right here. Oh my gosh, that was so lucky. That was so lucky that we found both of those guys. All right, let's keep going, you guys. Let's see, musk ox, musk ox. Okay, buddy. 
So where are you gonna be, my friend? Mr. Muskox? I don't know. I'm panicking. Don't panic. Okay, don't panic. There we go. I would have seen that if I had just calmed down. I was a little freaked out. And there's Mr. Walrus, but we are just a little bit too far away from him. It's kind of hard to find the walruses I'm finding. So let's see. We have a muskox again. He's going to be right here. I've got their pattern down really well. And then we're looking for Mr. Polar Bear. So he's going to be right. Oh, nope, 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 nope. He's going to be right here. Dang it, so I need to slow down. Oh, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this. Okay, let's try rescuing again. All right, Penguin, he's gonna be right here. So at least we have maxed out on penguins. We have all the penguins we could possibly get. And that means that the walrus is gonna be somewhere along here, because he would at least be too tall, you see? Starting to put that noodle to good work, coming up with some spots on how to search for these guys. All right, let's rescue a couple more, and then we're gonna see how many are left before we need to get to, oh yes, level up! Woo, max level on seals. All right, pan, or polar bear, polar bear. Yes! Got the polar bear. Actually, we're almost to level five on polar bears too. That is not bad. Let's pop back to the zoo just to check things out for a second. Wow, your zoo is now big enough to support a launch. What, for spaceships? What is this nonsense? You can find it to the left of the helipad? What on earth? This is the launch pad? From here, you can launch special space issues, rescues using space coins. I'm gonna sneeze, I'm so excited. I know that sounds ridiculous, but I'm gonna sneeze, I'm so excited. <laughs> Earn space coins by completing space requests to the left of the launch pad. What? Unlocked the polar garden, awesome. Okay, what, hang on, hang on. Space request, polar garden, space launching board. A red barn, space request available, the space hangar, go to the moon, go to Mars. I am like blown away. This is so cool. Look at my little astronauts everywhere. My little space astronauts. Okay, space request. Space request list. Go rescue the animals needed for the request and prep them for space. Oh my gosh. Come back here when you've completed the request to earn space coins. Use space coins to do a special to do special rescues at the launch pad. Oh my gosh. Uranus and Neptune both want sheep and Saturn wants a bear. Um Okay, we've got to do this. We've got to try this out. This is too cool. Okay, so we need to go get some sheep. We're going to pop over to the farm and we're going to go ahead and we're going to look for a sheep, you guys, cuz we have, oh my gosh, a $1,000 coin, are you kidding? Because apparently we have space requests. All right, the cow is gonna be like, cow, you're supposed to be nice and easy to find. Oh, we actually are missing some cows, what on earth? And there's the bunnies, well that's fine because we want sheep anyway. I need sheep for space. I never thought I would say those words, but they're all true, I need, I need to stop moving so fast. I need some sheep for space. We've, we're getting very close to the bronze trophy on our pigus, which is adorable. And there's a unicorn present somewhere here. All right, there we go. We got a little bunny. Uh, prep for space, I guess. Is that an option for the bunny? All right, unicorn. I'm trying to remember what pattern you're in. I'm going to mess this up, unicorn. I got it. I got the unicorn. I'm so glad. Oh, we're only one away from leveling up on all the unicorns. That's awesome. There's my sheep. All right, Mr. Sheep, where are you? Where are you, Mr. Sheep? There you are. We're gonna prep you for space. All right, add to zoo. Ah, oh, we needed, oh, because we needed to replace a sheep. I get it now. All right, oh man, and we were one away from a horse. What, and we're missing one horse. I didn't realize we hadn't finished the farm rescues yet. Well, we need to hurry up and find a space sheep. So cows and everybody, you're all awesome. I didn't realize we were so far behind on cows. What on earth? Well, now we're gonna like work on everything else at least. So one until bronze trophy. So we'll go ahead, we've got a bronze pig trophy. We're doing a pig like disco now. Oh, and here's another sheep, there we go. Let's prep this sheep for space. There we are, oh my gosh, we need to go see. Do we need more than one sheep to prep all the sheep for space? This is so exciting, let's go see, let's go see what we've done. All right, well, we need to come over. We need to celebrate, I think, was it with the pigs? 
who got the trophy just or who got the little plaque uh pigs pigs just, just got their little trophy so we need to come over here hang on Woo, pigs, yay, celebrate, celebrate with the pigs, yeah. I hope you're so happy, you're adorable. You know, growing up actually watching um, like the Wilbur thing, you know, Charlotte, Charlotte's Web, that was really, I loved that book in school and then watching like the good pig, the Wilbur, I think was his name maybe, the pig who thought he was a little sheepdog. I loved that, I loved that growing up. So pig who thought he was a sheepdog, favorite thing. Uh, uh, almost done. Pigs are awesome. Yay pigs. My cousin has a micro pig actually and he has my, my cousin's micro pig has a little onesie that says I love bacon. <laughs> it's really uh, It's pretty of Oh my gosh Look how cute they are You put little little like astronaut helmets on them. Oh my goodness. That's ridiculously cute All right, well, let's go check out our space request and we are going to send our sheep off to Uranus. So away it goes. On to Uranus. And that... <laughs> Shush, you guys. We're more mature than that. And now we are going to go ahead and try to find... Well, here's going to be a bunch of bunnies. If I don't misclick everything in the world. We're going to try to go ahead and find... Um, where on earth is the... Mr. Horse, where the heck were you? Hiding from plain sight. I got you mixed up with the cow, I think. Alright. So there's like... Unicorn. Here's another pig. Mm, there would be another pig if I would stop being so silly. Uh, and a unicorn. Where would the unicorn be here? I'm pretty sure. Think carefully. Here? Oh, I did it. I'm so proud of myself. And we just got Max on the unicorns. That is fantastic. And there's a sheep. All right, you guys. We've got to figure this out. This is going to be like a super... Where are the earth is... Where on space is the sheep even? There we go. Prepping you for space. Cow, I don't know where you were. That's okay though. I was just, I'm too excited. I'm thinking about space. I can hardly focus. And let's go ahead. And we are going to send our little, little sheep into space. Mars wants a seal. Oh, what's going on? No, our koalas escaped. <laughs> you guys, this is like a super special extra long episode because we're just like, oh, there's a koala in with the sheep. All right, whoops, what's going on over here? All right, everybody looks good, looks good. We need to collect the koalas. And then we're gonna go into space just once, just to get a taste of it, because I want to see what it's like. There's another koala. There's a whole bunch of koalas right here, but that's like their exhibit. Let's see, nobody in here. Nobody in here, ah, there's a koala. Right over there, I love this thing. Oh, there's two koalas in here, trying to blend in with the gray elephants. All right, there's a bear. And there's a koala. There we go. Oh, we got coins. Dang it. I was hoping for uh, perhaps being able to win something else. But there we go. So, can we go into the space hangar? Can we go to the moon? Can we start a moon? Oh my gosh. <gasps> you guys. This is our moon rescue mission. Oh, what did we just find? What are you? Are you a big lump? Oh my gosh. We got a triple! <laughs> I love Tribbles! Oh my goodness, I can't believe we got a little Tribble. Are we gonna get a little space monkey now? Uh, I wanna buy five more attempts. This is worth it because it's so hard to get this little guy. Hello? Hello? Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me! Oh, he's all the way over there? Okay, so we have rescued a Tribble. We're coming back. Moon messages review reviewed your zoo. Grade D minus. Wait and see. Decent Tribble exhibit from Rock Mooney. There you go, you guys. You told me you, I would be excited when we got to space missions. I had no idea it was going to be so adorable or it was going to be so soon. I thought space was going to be like a long, long time after like we got like the huge zoo. I thought it was going to be like after all of these other ones. So I am happy well pleased very excited we're probably going to be able to upgrade to a huge zoo next time that was really awesome we went on space missions we had disco parties it's fantastic i love how happy disco zoo makes me and i hope you guys enjoy it too so until next time when we shall go out and team rocket capture some animals to add to our zoo and send into space which is kind of awesome because in our 101 dalmatian series we have or breeding dalmatians to give to aliens so that they can like have their revered dalmatians in space it's it's all connected somehow you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it I love this I can't wait until next week when we will be able to enjoy some more disco zoo and I will see you guys then bye bye